good evening in this video i'll discuss about how to apply difference gmm or erolano and bond model in gretel i have the same data which i used for anderson and siao model in my last video in this data n is my dependent variable w k and y s are independent variables so i'll be applying difference gmm in this gretel if you go to the down of this gretel you find like calculator then new script and finally there is open gretel console if you click this open gretel console you find this option of console so let me drag it now i'll be applying this difference gmm so first and foremost i'll create the all independent variables by writing a single word like i write here list and then x and then equal to w k and y s and then enter what i find i find x as combination of all independent variables and then i write here d panel 1 then semicolon dependent variables which is nothing but n and then a space x so if i write x it means it will represent all independent variables and then constant semicolon and then a space gmm n to 99 and then a space gmm w comma 1 comma 99 and then space gmm and then k and 1 uh, 99 and then i write here gmm ys comma 99 and then space double dash d p d let me explain this command i have written here d panel 1 it means the lag 1 of dependent variable will be treated as independent variable it means lag n or lag 1 of n will be treated as independent variables then i write here dependent variable and then independent variable like x and then constant and finally these all are my instrumental variable gmm n comma 2 comma 99 it means i will consider lag 2 of n from lag 99 of n as instrumental variable similarly in the case of w lag 1 of w to lag 99 of w as instrumental variable and then so on now i have written here n comma 2 comma 99 but in the rest of the variables i have considered from lag 1 itself why what is the reason the reason is i have already included lag 1 of n as independent variable that's why i have started from lag 2 but in this case like in case of w k and y s i have only incorporated the this variable like the variable y s k and w but i have not included their lag 
that's why I have started from lag 1 to 99 if I consider lag 1 of all independent variables then the situation would be also here like uh, then we must write here lag 2 onwards but here as I have mentioned only W, K, Y, S that's why I have started from lag 1 to 99 as the instrumental variable. Now the question is either all variable will be considered up to this 99 lag as instrumental variable? No. I have given the command but suitable instrumental variable will be considered by this software. Right? And then I have mentioned here DPD. It means this is my dynamic panel data. That's why. And then enter. The moment I press on enter, I have got the result of difference GMM, which is nothing but Erolano and Bond model. Now, there are some conditions which we have to verify here. And these are like these are uh, six condition which we have to see in this dynamic panel analysis especially for difference GMM. Let me drag it. Okay, the first is the coefficient of lag of dv which is used as IDB should be significant and less than 1. If you see this n minus 1, the coefficient of it is less than 1 and it is significant also. So this condition is also met. Talking about second, second point is the number of instruments should be less than number of cross-sectional units. It means this number of instruments should be less than number of cross-sectional units. Like in this case, my cross-sectional units are 140 and it is less also. So this condition is also met. Talking about third, AR1 should be, AR1 should be significant. So by the way, AR1 is nothing but autocorrelation at lag 1. So if you see this autocorrelation, it should be significant. Only then we can say that there is requirement of dynamic panel or dynamic analysis and it is significant also. Talking about another condition like uh, condition number 4, it says that our AR2 should not be significant or it should be insignificant like uh, here AR2 is insignificant because its p-value is greater than 5%. Similarly, the Sargon test should be significant or, or you say that the Sargon test should not be should not be significant. What is the meaning of it? The meaning of it is the null hypothesis for this Sargon test is that the instruments are valid. It means whatever instruments you have considered in your study, like uh, in this case, I have given command 99 of each of the variables, but, the, but it has considered only 134 instruments. So either these instruments are valid or not. So that is represented by my Sargon over identification test. But unfortunately, this condition is not met because the Sargon test is significant here. The meaning of Sargon test significant is that whatever variables I have considered as instruments, these are not valid. Then what is the solution? And then condition number six is wall test should be significant. In this case, the wall test is significant. So uh, my model is fit. Now out of these six condition, 
each and every condition is met except the Sargon test because my instruments are not valid. So how to improve it? This command, if I see, this command is nothing but one way difference GMM. Basically, there are two types of difference GMM. One is, you can say one way and another one is, or you can say one step or another one is two step. So, if I write the same command and if I put this two way step and then a space, then let me check either the Sargon test value will be improved or not and then enter. Look, uh, if I see all conditions, again all conditions are met here like uh, this uh, the significance of uh, n minus 1, then instrumental variable, then AR1, AR2 and finally let me see here this Sargon test. The moment I write here two step, it means here my condition of Sargon test is also met. It means now I can say that the instruments are valid. Meaning is whatever instruments I have considered these are appropriate, these are valid and uh, W, K, Y, S, these all are the significant variables. So we have understood that two step uses the residual from one step. That is why the Sargon test becomes here insignificant and we say that instruments are also valid. So that is all about different ZMM. I hope you like it. Thank you very much.